Hey everybody, Zach again at NewTutorial.com, coming in and making a video for you today. Welcome to the Freak Show. So, a friend of mine this last week emailed me an article, an NPR article, that the National, let's see, what's it, what is it again? It's the National Institute of Health is proposing a new policy to permit scientists to get federal money to make embryos known as chimeras under certain carefully monitored conditions. Okay, if you don't know what a chimera is, you know, there's lots of different ways. A chimera could be like a twin or something like that, technically. But what they're talking about is taking animal uh, DNA and mixing it with human DNA, making it an animal-human hybrid. So, um... Before, there was like uh, some kind of, I mean, there was a moratorium on uh, funding these things, but that's about to be lifted, folks. At the end of this month, the public has 30 days to basically comment on this, to send these National Institute of Health morons, whatever their thoughts are, and, and then at the, at the end of, I think it's September 6th, the end of the 30 days, the National Institute of Health, uh, they're going to make the decision on whether or not to continue. I, like you have a say in this anyway. I mean, come on. Do you really think that you're going to be like, I sincerely object, you know, to the funding of such research and consider it, blah, blah, blah. They're going to be like, throw that away. Because these are Frankenstein people. These are nut jobs. These are freaks. And they're like, woohoo, we can play in the playground. We can take all this different stuff, basically pick up where the Nazis left off and start doing all this crazy experimentation. And... And and it's perfectly and now that, that is taxpayer funded. You're paying for it. Woohoo! I mean, everyone loves to do things, you know, with other people's money, right? Huh? Of course, it's not their money. Make them pay for it, you know, and make it actually produce something, you know, to where they have to actually sell it. These people have never worked a day in their life. I'm talking about actually producing something. They've never done anything. All they do is sit in a lab, and, you know, under your tax dollars and your funding that you paid, you know, from your hard-earned dollars that you went to go work at a job for and pay these people their money, their paychecks, and then they spend it doing all kinds of Frankenstein experiments in their science labs. Animal, human, chimeras. Let's take a look. There's an article over at sciencemag.org, and it says that these proposed studies will go to an internal NIH steering committee of scientists, ethicists, and animal welfare animal welf welfare experts, all insane, that will consider factors such as the type of human cells where they may wind up in the animal and how the cells might change the animal's behavior or appearance. So imagine imagine a pig with a human face or a half human face or a pig with human hands. Imagine a sheep, you know, with a human head and human hands, but with a nice fur coat. This is freak show stuff. We are living in the freak show. There is no doubt about it. <laughs> I just, this is real. They're doing this. I, and, you know, there's so many Bible verses you can go to. I'm not going to post any of them because there's so many you could go to. As it was in the days of Noah, so it shall be in the coming of the Son of Man. And people have long, you know, equated that to all of the, the stuff and the mixing of seed that was going on before Noah that brought about the destruction of man, all of this stuff, and, and using that as a way to, you know, rightfully so, you know, think about the coming, uh, the second coming of our Messiah. It is crazy. This is sin. You cannot take something the Father has made and may, make it better. It's perfect to begin with, you know, and it's been destroyed, you know, only by man's sin. And you're not going to fix it. And these people are going to try to fix it. And who knows what kind of spiritual warfare is going on behind the scenes with all this. Folks, this is nuts. I, here's the deal. At the end of this video, I'm go to the description below here. And I'm going to put down the link where you can go leave your thoughts, as colorful as they might be, you know, to these insane researchers, these Frankensteins who are considering using your public money, your federal tax dollars to fund this nonsense. And you can tell them what you think. I'm putting the link in the description below. So you have to go to YouTube. If you're finding this on Facebook or Twitter or wherever else, go to the YouTube channel, go to the description, and find the link and send them your thoughts. Send, send them some happy thoughts. Okay. All right. We'll leave it at that. Go home. Read your Bible. Thanks.